Just in case you missed our last upload, here's what you missed. Oh my god, this photo! No! Oh my god! What is up you guys? Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time you have already, make sure you smash the subscribe button below the video. Also make sure you smash the thumbs up button below the video because it'll taste basically pretty damn good. If you are a true Taylor and you probably already know our intro by heart as well as my coffee order, I do not know how much longer this drop is going to be up for grabs. So right now is probably your guys' last chance. If you can't get anything right now, don't worry. Our next drop is coming soon. But I did want to let you guys know in case you did want something from this drop, now is the time to get it. Sorry, I am so like gross and sweaty today. I literally have been meal prepping like all morning Probably wasn't a good idea to do right before filming. Okay, so you guys have really been liking the try on hauls lately I was organizing my closet the other day and I realized how many denim shorts I have and it's an uncomfortable amount You guys are also constantly asking me on my Instagram where I get my shorts as I post in a lot of shorts on my Instagram So I thought I would pick out my favorite few pairs go through them tell you guys where I got them from what I like about them And yeah, we can have a little bit of fun with it Try on hauls are my absolute favorite thing to film So if there's a specific try on haul idea that you guys have please comment it below because I will probably do it Okay guys, let's get started <music> goodness I'm gonna start with one of your guys favorites I feel like I haven't really answered where I got these so I did get these on Etsy but unfortunately that seller deactivated their account don't worry I am just as pissed off as you are I would like more but the good news is there's so many other shops that have this exact same pair the reason why these fit me so well is because I sent in my measurements they fit perfectly to my body which I recommend to anybody that wants a high-waisted pair of Levi shorts measure up send them in they will come out just like this Okay, these next pair of shorts are super basic. I got them at American Eagle. For some reason, it's really hard for me to find just a really basic pair of blue shorts that doesn't really have my ass falling out the bottom of it. These kind of did the trick, but if I'm wearing them for longer than like two hours, then my butt starts coming out the bottom, which is really annoying. But yeah, they're super cute. They make your booty look super cute. I'm not the biggest fan of American Eagle, but it's also just because it's not my style. I feel like all of their clothes are awesome quality. It's just not me. Okay, these next two pair of shorts are from the same place. The place in which I feel like every single girl has at least one pair of shorts from, and that would be PacSun, who won't sponsor me. But yeah, these are super cute. Um, what I love most about PacSun shorts is my butt never comes out of them, which is great for some people. Yeah, no, these are super basic and super plain, super simple, just summer shorts. Unfortunately, PacSun, charges a ridiculous amount for their shorts. I mean, these are $45 each, which I personally think is insane. But yeah, they're super cute though. These next pair of shorts are by Bullhead. I don't remember where I got them. I think Sun sells Bullhead, I'm not sure. I got these in a low rise short double zero, which is pretty much like all of the shorts I'm going to be showing. Oh, these are super cute. They're super vibrant. These are probably the brightest pair of shorts that I own. I am like a super big fan of neon. But yeah, these shorts are super cute. Um, I used to post in these shorts all the time. I probably had these shorts since I was 17 years old. They still fit me. Uh, they ride up sometimes, but they're super cute. Like I've said 18 times now. Yeah, probably one of my favorite pair of shorts. These next shorts are new. I just got them from V's Boutique. If you guys want anything from V's Boutique, make sure you use the code Taylor because you guys will get a discount code off. They have a ton of cute stuff. These shorts are probably in my top three favorite pair of shorts. These are super crazy and super fun and so different. Um, I don't see myself like wearing them to like a club but I do see myself wearing them like poolside, like over a bikini. Yeah, huge fan of these. Um, my number one thing I love about them is they're just so awesome to photograph in. I originally just got them for pictures. Yeah, super big fan of these. Okay, these next ones are by PacSun too. Um, these are probably my favorite fitted shorts just because they're super covered up. Um, I can wear them absolutely anywhere. They are unbelievably stretchy and super soft. Oh, well that makes sense. If you guys want this exact pair, it's literally super stretch shorty. That's literally what it is. I'm wearing a size 22, but yeah, they're just army green. They make your booty look really cute, which is always a plus. Yeah, I love these. Oh my god, okay. So I have had these shorts 
for so long. I've had these shorts since maybe I was 16 years old. These are another pair of shorts where I sent in my measurements to Etsy. I used to be good friends with the designer of these shorts. Unfortunately, she is out of business. She was so awesome. That was when I first started becoming big on Instagram and I started collaborating with companies um, and they were sending me out clothes and stuff, which was so fun. But yeah, her stuff was amazing. Hopefully you guys can find a similar pair, but these used to be my number one favorite pair of shorts. Yeah, they're just so crazy and so different and like one of a kind, like nobody, I haven't seen anyone in anything similar to this. These next shorts are like my favorite shorts for poolside just cause I feel like you want your booty out by the pool. Um, and I don't always like to just wear swim bottoms just cause I feel like I'm really exposed. It's so weird because I'm like down to take bikini photos. Like I love taking like bikini shoots and um, just photos in general. Like I just feel so comfortable behind a camera. But <laughs> if I'm by the pool, like if you guys ever saw me by the pool, I'm usually covered up. Like I can't even tan in front of people. I get so weird. Um, I just feel like super exposed. The camera has always made me feel way more comfortable than I am and it's definitely brought out a side of me over the past couple years that I didn't even know about myself so that's awesome but yeah so I usually wear these over my bikinis and then I'll probably just wear a crop top or if I'm feeling really comfortable with um my situations <laughs> that day then I'll probably just wear that but yeah usually that's what I'm in by the pool so I got these shorts at one of my favorite stores. Um, I came across this store about a year ago. If you live in LA, I'm sure you heard of the store. It's called LF. It's only sold in LA, but they recently went online and I have been splurging like there's no tomorrow. LF is so cool. They have so much like this is not sponsored. I literally, I wish, I wish. What I love about them is they have so much to choose from from one of a kind, um, which is stuff that nobody else can get. They only make one and once you buy it, no one else can, which I think is so cool. Um, I don't think that's the case for these shorts. I think they have a ton of them. Um, a lot of their stuff on their websites have like all chains and stuff, which you can take off and put on other outfits, which I think is super cool. But yeah, huge fan of these shorts. They're probably one of my most abstract, different pair of shorts that I own. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, it was super different, I'm aware. I'm trying to branch out with the try-on hauls, being that it's like my favorite thing to film. I'm trying to get creative with it. So if you guys have any ideas for me, any different try-on hauls that you think other people would want to see as well, go ahead and comment below. Also, if you haven't already by the end of this video, please subscribe. We want you here. I want you here. Um, also, make sure you smash the thumbs up button because you know today's video was pretty damn good. I love you guys. Stay tuned for our next video. I have never had to make one of these little add-ins before, but unfortunately, I don't have our next video edited just yet, so I can't show you guys. But I am going to be live streaming on YouTube tomorrow at 1 p.m. August 9th, so if you guys want to see me, make sure you're there. It's 1 p.m. Arizona time. We're going to be playing Trick or Dare, so things will get super interesting. Make sure you're there, and I love you guys.